Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to do a review on this Tadato sound level meter. So here's everything that comes in the box. It comes with this little screwdriver. We first have to put the batteries in. So take this little screw out. It takes two AAA batteries. That screw will fall out, so be careful. All right, so we got to stack them. You're going to put the positive side in first. Nope. The positive side goes down. And push that one up in there. That's a little bitty screw. Okay, so let's turn it on. There's what the display looks like. This comes off. It's got a nice little carrying case that comes with it. I like it. So it looks like it will 30 to minus 135 dB. Frequency 31.5 hertz to eight kilohertz. Okay, so you can long press it to power off. Short press. So we've got fast and slow. It'll say the word slow, fast, press it again, so it just alternates. So on fast, it's every constant time, 125 milliseconds. Slow, one second. So it, yeah, how much it's sampling the sound. Okay, so if we press and hold the max for two seconds, it goes into max. So that's the maximum sound it hears. It'll display. It's not displaying the current sound level, but the maximum that it's heard. So press it again, and it comes out of it. So it does shut down after 10 minutes if you haven't used it. Okay, so I bought it to see how loud these vacuums are. Looks like it has a backlit display. So I can point it at it and see that, you know, that vacuum looks like it's about a six, 66 dB level, 70. Let's measure overall length, almost eight inches, left to right about inch and three quarters. Thickness, about three quarters. Again, that's just a sound. So I hope this video helps. Thanks everybody for watching.